Welcome to Nene Imagination's Tiles of Infinity. This introductory video is designed to tell you a little bit about the puzzle, and also give you some hints about how to start playing it. The puzzle comes with two basic shapes, kites and darts. In this case, the kites are purple and the darts are yellow. These shapes were invented by the renowned English physicist and philosopher, Sir Roger Penrose. The kites and darts each have two long and two short edges, and one of the biggest secrets of the puzzle is that the ratio of the edges, long to short, is equal to the golden ratio. The golden ratio can be found throughout nature. It can be seen in seashells, it's in the arrangement of flower petals, in the shapes of the waves on the ocean, and even among the spirals of a hurricane. The golden ratio is in human beings as well, from our DNA to the proportions of our body. Not surprisingly, it's affected our view of beauty and influenced the art we create. It's in the buildings that we make, as well as the decorations we build into them. Once you know what to look for, it's easy to see the influence of the golden ratio in the designs you'll create using tiles of infinity. Now let's start to assemble a pattern. The easiest way is to start with five of the same shape. Let's start with five darts and let's put them into a star, and then gather five kites. Now let's begin to fit the kites, short edge to short edge, to the corresponding spaces on the star, Go all the way around until the pattern is symmetric. You repeat this process over and over, each time circling around your base pattern with a new piece fitting into a new spot. If you don't want gaps to exist, make sure you fit long sides to long sides and short sides to short sides. Eventually though, you might find the gaps are a nice addition to your patterns and they can make a nice contrast to the other colors. But experiment with different pieces in different spots, and remember that each piece has two long and two short sides. But the important thing is to go around symmetrically, well, if you want symmetry, and fill in the pattern until you're out of pieces or you're satisfied with it. One of the best ways to introduce variety into the patterns you create is to start with a new central figure. Let's try using five kites to form a decagon. Then again, you go around the central figure with another shape, let's try some darts, until you have a symmetric looking pattern. Tiles of Infinity come in many colors and styles, adult and children's versions. You can make many different patterns using these color and style variations. Finally, please remember that the beautiful silicone bag that the tiles come in can and should be easily repurposed as a toy for kids, or as an accessory for adults. Thanks for listening.